Hey there everyone, Trizu here. Welcome back to the Fallout 4 Collection series. Only two issues left of Live and Love, and uh, <laughs> I'm still lucky because I'm still going somewhere safe today. Actually, re returning. Uh, I I'm going back to Good Neighbor again! Because apparently this place is just a safe haven for all kinds of good mag magazines and, uh, and other collectibles. This is... Is this a third or fourth time I've had to come here? There's obviously for the storyline. Could have sworn there was a time before the storyline. Because I ran in here easily during the storyline. So the first time you show up and you get to see... Uh, uh, I can't remember his name. Hancock stab a boy. I don't think that was during my storyline, so... I'm pretty. Oh no, I had to come here looking for Imogene. So yeah, this is like the fourth time I've had to come through here. What am I gonna tell his mom? Red, are you going to hang out in the lobby all day again, or are you actually going to go down and do some work? Being available to the customers is work. It's not all about cooking and canvas clothes. Okay. <laughs> okay, it's just here. Okay, an experience to remember. Well, okay. Kind of thought I'd have to dig a little harder. My mistake. Before you even start, let's get to the point. We have rooms, one room specifically. Payment due up front. Yeah, not really here for that. Are these owned? Damn. Is this single 45 round just sitting on the table? Why? Manage your ammo. I just clean up around here. Congratulations. Hey there. You knew around good neighbor, if I'm not mistaken. What do you think of the place? Uh, well, I don't hate it. Later. <laughs> Everything's owned, and I don't want to be a total dick. <laughs> that was abundantly short. I, I legit thought I'd have to scour that hotel a lot more because I didn't remember this magazine at all. Truth be told. It's amazing how some of these magazines stick in your head. And some of them just nothing. Nothing whatsoever. And I guess it does stand to reason that the ones that stick in my head are the ones that involve a lot more effort and adventure. Like the garage, the parking garage for that issue of Hot Rider. Like, that's kind of unique. They make you go through that obstacle course maze thing. And this one, where it's just laying on a counter, less memorable because, well, I didn't have to fight for it, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, it's on the rack, and there remains but one issue of Live and Love, so we will return on the next episode to find it, so I will see you then.